The promised land is available, but are you ready to contend with the giants? You must understand that if you must outshine, outsmart, and force submission from those giants, you have to move into those territories with an anointing. It's more than a job, my brother. It's more than just getting a job in a good organization. It's warfare. You are going into a mantle to, to contend with giants that have existed before your parents were born. What did Caleb say to Joshua? He said, I remember when I was together with you, when I was 40 years, when Moses gave, gave us this place. He said, now I'm 80 or 85, but I still have the strength of my youth. He said, now give me this mountain. Before that time, no other tribe of Israel had gone to Joshua. They will wait for Joshua to conquer battles and they were waiting for their allocation to come to them as bread and tea. There are two sides in this army. It's either you choose the side of children that just want tea and bread. Everything should be served to them. Everything should be rolled to them on a red carpet. Or you choose to enlist yourself in the army of God like the mighty men of David. Men who will hold on the spear of the Lord and put themselves against the enemy and bring down 800 soldiers. Mighty man.